morning everyone, it is 9.48 and honest, he just woke up about 10 minutes ago. I'm scurrying to uh, get some homemade pancakes ready that I found a recipe online. I've made blueberry pancakes here and as you can see, this is going to be her breakfast this morning. She's going to have some leftovers for a couple of breakfasts. Uh, basically... All that's in the mixture is flour, sugar, cinnamon, baking powder, salt, milk, and unsalted butter, and vanilla extract. And it looks delicious. And I added blueberries. This is some yogurt, and some almond butter, and a little bit of crushed up banana, and uh... So now she can have it over her um, pieces. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put it on a tray with a fork. Relax. I'm going to have some pancakes too. I've got two of them, a half a banana, and two yogurt. And this girl is going crazy for her food. She was just like talking up the storm. I just missed it. Since I put the camera on, she hasn't talked much. Well, not talking, babbling up the storm, I should say. We're watching Barney now on the standby. And she just drank some water on her own from the cup. That's the only thing. When she does drink from the cup, she likes to uh, put her hand in the cup. Oh, she's so cute. Anyway, yeah, so she puts her hand in the cup and what a cutie. For lunch, Honesty is having some tofu, broccoli, and sweet potato. Yeah. Tofu, broccoli, sweet potato. Oh, you're getting it all over yourself. And then after she's done, she's going to go down for her nap. Uh, well, she's going to have some milk to drink and uh, half a banana and uh, half of, I don't know, maybe a kiwi or something. And then once she wakes up from her nap, we're going to have a play date with Liam and Aiden at the uh, park. And Honesty's going to get to go in the snow for the first time. Honesty's eating her fruit. I'm going to empty the dishwasher and fill it back up with what we have here. And then uh, she'll be going down for a nap. I'm guessing 
I'll have to put her down for her nap before I finish up the dishwasher, but I'll come back up and finish that. Clean up the play yard. And finally, hopefully, actually no, it's not gonna happen. It's more important that I get yesterday's vlog edited. Um, and then the photos edited for his, for the uh, shoot with his family. And then if I have any time before she wakes up from her nap, um, then I will fold some more clothes. I also have to get ready to uh, go to the play date. So I'll probably unfold the, oh no, I don't have the stroller. Oh. Well, that's just wonderful. Matt has the stroller in the car, so I don't even have the stroller right now, and I have a play date. So I guess I'm carrying her for two minutes, and trust me, that doesn't sound like a lot, but when you've got like a 30 pound baby and you're not strong, that's a lot. For lunch, I'm having some chicken stew with some, actually not just some, uh, quite a bit of sweet potato. There wasn't much soup left, like half a container, so like maybe one cup or something. And so I mixed it with a bunch of sweet potato and it looks delicious. So that's what I'm gonna eat for lunch while I'm editing yesterday's video. Honesty playing in the snow for the first time. Her friend isn't here yet, but he'll be here soon. Look at that. <gasps> wow. Are you having fun? She's already tasted oh some God. snow. That's a car. Wow, baby girl. What you doing? Make a smile. What am I going to use? Your fingers. What? Too bad we didn't have some rocks. Hi, Liam. Oh. <laughs> Are you having fun? Look, Honesty. Look, look at the snow <laughs> Honesty's rolling around in the snow. What are we gonna eat? Maybe just some snow? I think I'll use some snow. What do you think? Are you, are you just gonna use your fingers to poke the holes? Yeah. Just a minute, I have an idea. Wow. And there's our snowman. It's Aiden wants it to be a, a version of Honesty. That's a snow woman or a snow girl. <laughs> oh, are you stuck? We should like put some uh, little rocks on our hair, like like hair. <laughs> yeah. Oh, you know what you could use for hair? Those little uh, little uh, thingies right there. The grass. For supper, Honesty's having some chicken. A little bit of fries, some broccoli and cauliflower, and then of course she's gonna have some banana and fruit. Mmm. Now we're on our way to do some errands. Um, I forgot to show you guys what I have for supper. I had a uh, festive chicken Kaiser meal, and so did Matt. I got vegetables with mine. He got uh, fries with his, and we just shared some of our meal with honesty like we gave her some chicken and a little bit of stuffing and uh, some of the vegetables and a little bit of fries as you saw anyway so we're off to do a couple errands at Superstore Walmart potentially the dollar store and then we're gonna go home Matt has to work I have to work edit photo Oof. I have to edit photos and uh, post yesterday's vlog and work on tom yeah, tomorrow's vlog. Work on today's vlog and fold clothes, hopefully. So, busy night. It is one o'clock in the morning and I am feeling so overwhelmed right now. Like, you can tell my face is just. Whew, totally bloating. I'm breaking out really bad. I've been like that for the last week or so and uh, it might have been something to do with a combination of 
putting makeup on, which is why I don't use makeup very often. I probably will be during the Christmas days there, like Christmas Eve, holy crap. I uh, was really stressed out today. Not today for the whole day, but this evening. Um, I had a great time during the play date with uh, Patricia and Liam and Aiden. And then I asked Matt to come get Honesty and I because he forgot to bring the uh, stroller in. What we need to do is we need to get one of those lightweight strollers that can hopefully still plow through a little bit of snow. Because that's the only time we're really going to go to the park is when it's clear enough, you know, that we don't have to, like, <laughs> worry if we can even get the stroller there. But it was really hard to carry almost 30 pounds of honesty uh, two minutes down the street to the park. Like, it really hurt my lower back and my arms. I'm just out of shape. I asked him if he could come get us from the park and then he kind of made a fuss about it which really upset me. I'm like, she's really heavy. Like, he complains. He won't even take her out of the seat at the zoo very often because he's like, oh, she's so heavy, you know? Like, <sighs> sometimes I wish he had more empathy. And so, anyways, uh, he came and got us and then, like you saw, we went to go eat at Social Aid, but he was complaining, he's like, I've got a lot of work to do, and like, if you would just let me work, I wouldn't have to work for the next, uh, three, like, the next week or so, or whatever, or a week or two, somewhere between there, and I'm like, yeah, but look, like, I'm sorry, but we have a few things to get before Christmas Eve. We can't just leave this until the 24th or the 23rd, like, tomorrow we're going to his sister's. We're not going to have any time to really do any errands. So because he didn't want to wait or go get our photos at Walmart, <laughs> we ended up going to do a couple things first, like Superstore, and then he went into the dollar store to get some of the stuff, stocking stuffers for honesty, and <sighs> just, he's always in a rush. And like, Sure, this job makes him more money, but it's not going to be worth it if it's, like, trying to get him, like, if I feel like I have to force him to spend time with Honesty and I, or, like, I just, <sighs> there's got to be a balance, and he doesn't know how to do that, and it's almost Christmas, and I just, I want to relax and enjoy it. I don't want to see it fly by and not even be happy during it. And it just doesn't feel like he feels that way. Anyway, so we were arguing about that, him rushing me and not wanting to do this and that. So I said, you know what, fine, I won't get pictures printed at Walmart. Maybe you can pick up those pictures we got done through the photo studio and get them after work before you come home, before we go to your sister's. And so he's like, yeah, I can do that. And I was like, well, let's get photo paper. I'll just print everything and hopefully they come out decently because, you know, that's all we can do right now. <laughs> then he tells me that his mom stopped by his work today. I don't know. Just kind of odd. Like, come in. They obviously really don't want to be near me because... Why don't they just come visit afterwards when Matt comes home from work or after supper? So I did that photo shoot. I had an okay time doing it. Um, it wasn't perfect. Could have went better. Could have went worse. So that's a good thing. But uh, <laughs> that little rocking chair, his mom made cushions for it. And I really like the cushions. And I'm not even, like, for some reason, she's got it in her head that I don't like them. Because during the photo shoot, I took them off. Because I'm a photographer, and I understand that certain things clash and certain things don't. If they were more plain, sure, that's fine. But I had a backdrop that was a certain color. Honesty's 
Honesty's dress was a beige, which went with the brown backdrop um, and the brown chair. But putting this like bright baby blue cushion in the photo shoot, like it didn't make sense to me. I just, that's my opinion. I'm OCD and I'm a perfectionist and it doesn't mean it's not nice for like say a photo shoot that would have been in your face. Like say I had a backdrop with a bunch of like little dots or something on it or like it was very bubblegummy. Like the pink backdrop I have would be perfect with that. And she's like, well, I really want a photo with her in it. Like, I don't know what she's trying to prove to herself or me or if she's trying to get approval or if she wants honesty's, like, admiration later on in life and be like, oh, you sat in Nanny's chair because she sat in my mom's chairs and stuff like that. I don't know, but... All I know is that when you start accusing me of not liking you, it's not that I don't like his family. I don't like how they treat me and how they plain out and out are two-faced. And, and I'm not talking about all of his family. I'm just talking about his immediate family. And uh, yeah, the, the chair is gorgeous. And so are the little... Um, uh, and so are the chair covers. Look. So that's what it looks like up close in case you guys haven't seen it. Those are cute chair covers. It's got Cinderella. It's got Cinderella and Prince Charming. Like, why would I not like that? I wasn't trying to offend you. That was not my intention when I took those cushions off. It was merely for aesthetics, and that is all. And, you know, like... I said I wanted a family photo shoot, and so did his sister. We both were on the same page there. But then his parents showed up not wearing, I don't know, not wearing um, something photo shoot ready, you know? Like, uh, I don't know, it was just weird. And then they get mad or she gets mad about this chair thing and I'm trying to make an effort with them and every time I do it just blows up in my face and I can't stand it anymore so stressful anyway I'm gonna stop yammering on here this is getting really long and I'm only gonna have so much time to edit so I'm gonna close up the vlog for tonight good night everyone